Now, quick peck or a slow snog under the mistletoe? I've seen Tony Husband at the Christmas party. Yeah, oh, uh, <laughs> too easy. What do you prefer then? I'm not. I think I'd prefer you to carry on with the link. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Uh, a wildlife charity says the festive plant now needs our support. Actually, the Sussex Wildlife Trust wants people to record where they see mistletoe in the countryside. And it's encouraging us to buy British. Mark Sanders has the story. An early buyer gets busy before the strip trees people grab all the mistletoe. For a boy in short trousers in a black and white world, a stolen kiss under the mistletoe was enough to keep out the winter chill. But mistletoe is becoming an increasingly rare sight in the countryside, this clump we spotted near Ditchling. The Sussex Wildlife Trust is monitoring where it's found and wants people to let them know of any sightings. Records for mistletoe is, you know, they're very scarce. Particularly in Sussex, you know, there's one or two places that we know of it. But um, we'd really be keen to hear hear more. And if anybody's seen any about, to let us know. Lost habitat is a problem. Most mistletoe we buy comes from traditional cider apple orchards, but these orchards are disappearing. Cookfield is a traditional Sussex village. Are they keeping up the mistletoe tradition here? If it's not a personal question, when was the last time you had a, a kiss under the mistletoe? <laughs> I'm not offering, um, but I'm just asking. <laughs> um, I don't think I've ever had a kiss under the mistletoe. <laughs> We've already bought some. Ah, is this a tradition for you? Um, it is for me and my fiancé, so, yep, we bought it at the Christmas fair last week. Are you buying mistletoe this year? No. Why not? I'd like to think that my husband would kiss me without it. The Sussex Wildlife Trust wants people to buy mistletoe from a sustainably managed source. It's to support the orchards where it's found. It's been a very good seller this year. We've been able to source ours locally and it's just been a really good year for the mistletoe. The message is that after encouraging romance through the ages, it's mistletoe that now needs our love and support. Mark Sanders, BBC South Today, Cookfield. <laughs> You know, little hop, skip my, and a jump, he's so happy. My garden's got loads of mistletoe, I've brought it in, it's all over uh, the house, it's everywhere. Yeah, <laughs> girls will be queuing up outside, uh, Tone. That's it from us, more at 8 and 10.25. Join us tomorrow if you can. Thanks for watching, bye-bye.